now we will see some examples in those pronouns we already learned it in the first part okay look personal pronouns example in english afarmo chinese and america i will show you in those four languages okay just follow me i am your friend when we say i am your friend will be in a formal like this one ani hriya yokis jala keti ani hriya keti ani hriya keti hriya means friend keti means just to indicate your ani hriya keti or we can say ani jala keti ani hriya keti like this or ani jala keti like this we can use in both of them okay in both of ways uh, the in case of chinese we can say like this one wo shi ni de peng you wo shi ni de peng you as i already told you some chinese Ch Chinese character contains some tone, so I will put it those tone on the upper main on the main vowels on the main vowels. Wo contain the third. Sh contains the fourth tone. Ni da contains the third tone. The no tone. Peng yo. Pe contains the second tone. Yo. Uh, no tone needed for this one. Wo shi ni de peng yo means I am your friend. Ani jala keti yo kis ani riya keti. Wo shi ni de peng yo like this. Wo shi ni de peng yo means in English I am your friend. Okay, you got it. In case of Amharic, we used to say "ine guadenya hening," "ine guadenya hening," "ine guadenya hening," "ine guadenya hening" means in case of English, "I am your friend." Okay, you got it. This one also. Let's go. Here, on this example, we will see by using "you." You speak very fast. You speak very fast will be in a form of that dafte dubata. That dafte dubata. That dafte means very fast. That dafte dubata means speak, say something like that. That dafte dubata. In case of Chinese, we used to say "ni shoda" and "kuai." I would put some tones on "ni" on the third tone. "Sho" I would put it on "o." "De" no tone needed. "Han" the third tone. "Kuai" the fourth tone. Like this, when we read or when we speak in Chinese, "ni shoda" and "kuai," "ni shoda." Like this. In case of uh, Amharic, we used to say, but am, but am, but but am, but am, but am, but am, but but am, but but am, but am, but am, but am, but am, but Fast. The third tone. Will, the third example will be concerning sh. I hope that one. H. Concerning h. He has four books. He has four books. Will be in a form written like this. N. N means he. Kitaba means book. Afur means for. Kaba means has. 
when we read it in a form in kitaba afur kaba or sometimes we can say here there is a plural over here books so we can say in a form like this one kitabota 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 we can say inni kitabota afur kaba we can say inni kitabota afur kaba or we can simply say inni kitaba afur kaba that's also no problem in case of chinese we can say ni yo si ben shu ni yo si ben shu uh, here sorry uh, ta yo si ben shu ta yo si ben shu ta yo si ben shu ta means in or he we put it the tone on a yo Yo, we put it the third tone on O. S, the fourth tone. Pen. Um, pen, also the fourth tone. Shu, the first tone, like this. Ta, yo, s, pen, shu. Ta, yo, s, pen, shu. Like this. Ta, yo, s, pen, shu. Ta means he. Yo means has, just has. Si means for. Ben su means ben. In case of this sentence, ben indicate a major word for books. Shu means book, like this. Ta yo si ben su. In case of Amharic, we used to say arat masahift alut. Arat masahift alut. Arat masaift alud. If he arat masaift alud. In case of this sentence, we used to say arat masaift alud like this. We will continue, and we will see in case of uh, the pronouns. She can speak Chinese. She can speak Chinese. Will be in a fanromo. Afan China big tea. Afan China big tea. Here, big tea here is indicating the gender. She, indicating the gender. She, China means Chinese. Afan China means here, this one Chinese. Afan China big tea. She can speak Chinese. Afan China big tea. In case of Chinese, you can say like this one. Tao hui shu zhong wen. Ta will be the first tone. Hui will be the fourth tone. Shu will be the first tone. Zhong will be the first tone. Wen will be on E on the upper, uh, on the above E vowel. We put it the second tone when we read. Like this. Ta means she. Hui means can. Shu means to speak. Zhongwen means Chinese. Ta hui shu zhongwen. Ta hui shu. In case of Amharic, we can say like this one. In case of Amharic, Chaininya Managar Tichila Lich. Chaininya Managar Tichila Lich. Tichila Lich indicates a gender for she. Tichila Lich. Who can speak this one? Is someone else's Chinese manager teacher language? Who can speak Chinese? She, she can speak Chinese. So we can easily say in case of Amharic, Chinese manager teacher language. 
is going to see the, the other one. In case of here, we will see by using we. We are a student. We are a student. When we used to say in a form, the sentence we are a student will be like this one. Nuti baratota. Nuti baratota. Nuti baratota. Like this. In case of Chinese, woman shi. Woman shi. Shui sheng. Woman shi. Shui sheng. Look, I will put some tone on the pin syllable. Woman shi. Contain the, the fourth. Shui sheng. The second tone. Sheng. No tone. So when we read that one also, it will be soft and no more emphasizing. Woman shi shui sheng. Woman shi shui sheng. Woman means we. She is verb to be to indicate are. Shui sheng means student. So we can easily say in Chinese we are student will be woman shi shui sheng like this one. In case of Amharic, tamari nen. Tamari nen. Nen is indicating we. Tamari is just to indicate a student. Okay? I think you are feeling more good and interesting. So we will continue to the last example concerning personal pronouns. The last pronoun, the, the last example will be they. They are coming. When we say they are coming in a fan romo, it will be Isan Kufa Jiru. Isan Kufa Jiru. Isan means they. Kufa Jiru means are coming. Kufa Jiru. Isan Kufa Jiru. Isan Kufa Jiru. Kufa Kufa like this. Kufa in case of Chinese we can say Tamen Laila. Like this. I put it the tone over here and Laila on this one. L and men no tone needed for them in this sentence. Tamen Laila. However, when we uh, when we directly translate Tamil Laila or when we sense the sentences it may not seem like they are coming, however, they are sending, okay? They are sending. Tamen Laila. Tamen Laila. Like this. In case of Amharic, we used to say, Iyamatu no. Iyamatu no. Iyamatu no. Iyamatu means indicating they. No means just to make that sentence complete. Yamatu no. Yamatu no. Thank you for watching an example for personal pronounces. We will see dress pronounces on the coming tutorial. Don't be uh, late to follow my tutorial. If you have any question concerning my tutorial and if you have any comment, you can write for me down, down here uh, and you can subscribe my channel for more videos. Uh, I would be happy if you always follow my tutorial and get some knowledge about learning languages. Thank you very much. I will see you on the coming tutorial.